Everybody's doing good. <clears throat> I've uh, pulled away from this setup that you saw in uh, about seven. Obviously, no magnets in there, but that's the setup we had in uh, that one. So, and this is what we got right now. These are rail shaped cores that I've just super glued together for now just to keep them stuck together. Um, this is, I don't know if you can see this, I don't know if we were set for 30 or 60 frames per second, but. That looks good on the screen. It's spinning pretty fast. We're uh, operating at 60 hertz right now. The scope here is tapped on the uh, on the input coil. Got a center tap, which I think was 35 turns, and then from 35 turns to the other end of this one is. Uh, um, I think that was 45 or 50. <clears throat> so we get roughly uh, 50, 60, 75 turns total. Right in there. Nine three quarter inch, uh, eighth inch magnets. And then another top bar. And it's on there pretty good. Can't pull it off when it's running. And uh, when this is set up in the off position, um, get a small amount of flux north and south. And there's the middle point, which is all the way up to the middle of the coil. Um, let me slow this down just a little. Fifteen hertz, and uh, here's the flux off the side. What's going on with this camera? That's spewing right off the end. So, transformer lam laminations. I believe this was uh, two C's. It was a 90 piece that went that way that made like the bottom, except they were welded on this end for some reason. And it was a ballast transformer. I think uh, a 2000 watt. Um, Alice transformer for uh, HID illumination. So nice flux switch in here in comparison to the uh, ferrite. So my next step is obviously to line coils on here and see what I got. I'll probably put um, I'll probably put 15 gauge, I mean not 15, 18 gauge on there, <clears throat> and uh, see what we get for output on it. I haven't uh, gave up on this one, I actually like what it's doing, but my next step is to, is to wind some heavier wire on that, and see what my output comes out to on that for current and for volts. Um, but I've also got this one going too, so I'm going to wind both of them. It's Saturday and I haven't gotten around to doing it. I've had to deal with doing other things, but um, as you'll see. This one I'm, uh, this here is another setup I've got, which I'm going to send off to, uh, Captain Gary. And, uh, 
I set up like that so he can experiment with it. And uh, we'll see where this takes us. Interesting. Uh, flux flying right through this thing like nothing. Um, and of course, you know, 50, 60 hertz. The transformer lamination is designed to work in that frequency, so we can uh, harvest these magnets with a small amount of input power and get a big enough power coming out, more than what we're putting in, obviously. Um, 